Good morning, family. How are you? Welcome to the Jazzy Hair Family. I hope you are here to subscribe in your hip today. Welcome to the Jazzy Hair Family. I hope you are here to subscribe in your hip today. Jazzy, Jazzy, Jazzy. So we are about to get Carter off to school and then we are going to run some errands. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> you don't want to see Miss Spencer? He be bugging. See you in a little bit. <laughs> Is the squad. This morning, I needed a mental health break, baby. I am outside to pick up my best friend. I haven't seen her in so long. And me and her are about to go to breakfast at Denny's. I needed I needed a mental health break. I just needed to get out the house for a second. And I, I feel like, oh, I see you. Honestly, I feel like we spend so much time being mothers and wives and everything that everybody want us to be that we forget to be who we are to ourselves. And um, I'm not about to lose me for nobody. So I need a break. Uh, I'll see y'all in a little bit. Oh, hey. Why? I bet you, bitch, we could have got um fucking senior citizenship or something. It's the the only Denny's in New York City. So I had an absolutely amazing time at breakfast with my best friend. I told y'all sometimes we just gotta remember that you know we're not only wives and mothers we just and it don't happen often it's just just take a minute i wish drinks could have been involved but it's too early in the morning and um also i don't know why i'm smiling like this is a good thing because i felt so shitty afterwards kaisha play too much kaisha is always pranking somebody like always pranking somebody always playing with you always doing some shit to you so i wanted to give her a taste of her own medicine problem is i did it at a bad time i pranked kaisha and i sent her like a breakup text message and right oh but you know this brooklyn and right now she currently doesn't feel well because she has sinuses and it's like really bad honestly i'm i'm not too knowledgeable about sinuses i didn't even know people could be going through so much when the season changed and shit i didn't even know it gets this bad but apparently sinuses could really fuck with you so i picked a bad time but i sent her a breakup text and it was supposed to be like long and i was supposed to go with it but then i felt so bad and she started crying oh my god it was just horrible so here's what i sent here's the messages right there so i had text her this and then she replied with that and uh, I really was planning on keep going like for a long time like really OD but she was just laying in the dark and in pain and not feeling well and I was like fuck like damn it just you don't play with bitches like that so she's like it was bad she started crying I felt so bad I, oh my god I'm so I'm so so sorry I'm sorry <laughs> 
I would have thought it was a joke at first, and then I'm like, I just couldn't think shit because I'm sick. I feel so bad. Is it okay? No. Mm -hmm. Why would you cry? Because I feel well. So it just came out. Oh, I saw me. I thought that you wouldn't take it as a prank because we was just talking. No, I thought you said that you heard you tell me to call me. Anyway. Oh. I feel so bad. Is it okay? No. Mm -hmm. Why would you cry? Because I feel well. So it just came out. Oh, I saw me. I thought that you wouldn't take it as a prank because we was just talking. No, I thought you said that you heard you tell me to call me. Anyway. Oh, I'm sorry, baby. I'm so sorry. I will never play with you like that again. Ever. I'm so sorry, baby. I felt like shit. But nonetheless, bitch, I pranked you. I got you. You can't say I didn't get you. But y'all, now I am about to go in the house and love up on my baby. I'm not doing this whole big cooking thing because i'm not in the mood i'm going to fry some pork chops and i'm gonna make them some macaroni and cheese i'm not doing a whole spiel tomorrow i have a little tiktok hack i don't know if y'all like these little tiktok things i'll be coming up with but when i see them on tiktok i'll be wanting to know if they lying or telling the truth so i'm gonna try it i'm gonna give you my honest opinion so i am going to do this little like cute little meal it's so y'all gonna y'all gonna love it i hope it's the real deal but y'all gonna love this one we're gonna save that for next time go in the house and cook this little food and get these goddamn kids off it is beautiful outside back in my days girl mm, mm, mm. i could smell the white nail polish now with the sundresses and no panties baby back in my day before i was committed girl i would have had my little sundress on with my little white nail polish right now just letting that thing wibble wobble wibble wobble wibble ha hey, i would have been out and about i would have said brunch yes mimosas Let's go! But you know, I'm a saint now. Hmm. I lived for the Lord. And um, I'm not about to be out here taking part in nobody whole antics because I ain't got time. But if you want to be a whole bitch, I encourage you to do so. I'll be right here. Hey, get it, bitch. Um, hoe a little bit for me, feel me? See you later. Baby. Okay, so now that we are back in the house, I thought that I was just gonna come make something real quick and just lay down, but I just had to start scrolling through TikTok and I seen someone doing a cleaning hack. And this is the cleaning hack. They are cleaning their cabinets, honestly. I looked at my cabinets and realized they are filthy on the outside because the kids are disgusting and stuff spill on everything and fall and no one wipes it up everyone waits for me so it's just mad gunked up caked up is the nastiest thing you'll ever see you won't see it they said to use some degreaser and like a scrubbing pad the degreaser they use you can only find it on amazon so i wanted to use something that anyone can find that's affordable that's everywhere so i seen this degreaser by awesome I don't really mess with these awesome things. I know everybody swear by this that it clean, but you will be choking till you die. I'll be feeling like I'm dying. That's why I don't use awesome products. But hopefully, this one is not as bad. Okay? So we're gonna see. Wipe it immediately. It say this is a, a it cleans and degreases, and this is it. I know it say grill and oven, but it cleans and degreases. So that's what we want. And I feel like you could find this anywhere. And this was only $2. That other one was like $17.99. And I also got some Brillo scrubbing pads. They not like the Brillo pad. They like this. And we're going to see if we can get these cabinets clean. We're going to see if this is a hit or a miss. So here is the cabinets. I know they are so nasty. It be clean. Down here, different story. It's just mad nasty, like dumb nasty because stuff just be spilling it's just gross so let's see if this really works if you're watching this right now i suggest you get up go in your kitchen and look at your cabinets you guys know i am a super clean person and this is just something that i genuinely 
overlook or just didn't have time to do. Like, the kids always making a mess in the kitchen, and I never thought to sit down and scrub the cabinets. I just didn't have time to do that. And I'm so happy I did. It was so filthy. The kitchen looked so much brighter, so much cleaner. Friend, get up right now and walk to your kitchen. I'm telling you. So here is our after, and this is a TikTok pass. This actually worked amazing. Alright, my love for you now is the 